Welcome to our cruel and unusual kettlebell workout. This is sequence number 10. You will need two kettlebells. We will perform 10 exercises listed here. We will do 10 repetitions of each. You can work out at your own pace and do as many repetitions as you like. We will start with a swing. We will do 10 swings with both kettlebells. Let them travel up to your shoulder level. And after 10, we'll bring them to your shoulder position in a rack position and start doing alternating presses. Very simple exercise, just press one arm at a time. Brace your stomach, make sure you don't bend over backward as you're pressing kettlebell up. And press your arm slightly back, make sure kettlebell right over your shoulder. Next exercise will be clean and squat. We start with cleaning elbow to the rack position and squat down. Maintain neutral arch at your lower back. Go down at slower pace as far as you can. Try to get as deep as you can in your squat but only as long as your lower back stays straight. Next exercise will be squat and alternating presses from the bottom of the squat. For that we will clean kettlebell, do front squat as before. From the bottom of the squat we will press one arm, other arm and then stand up. Again we will squat, press with the right, press with the left, stand up straight. If you're not able to press from the bottom of the squat, your option will be either press it standing up and then go into squat or get into half squat position and practice pressing them from a half squat. When you're done, make sure when you're pressing them, you try to keep your weight still on the whole foot, don't let your heels come off the floor. Press your arm slightly back, so kettlebell right over your shoulder and not forward. And keep your chest up. Next exercise is clean, squat and press. So clean kettlebell, squat and press it up. It's like we're doing thrusters but we clean in between. Clean kettlebell, squat and go up and press. Make sure to generate power with your legs. Go down slowly, go up fast, creating momentum. Make it easy on your arms. Next exercise will be alternating side bends with the press. Put your feet wider, bring kettlebell initially to the rack position. Bend to one side, look up and press kettlebell into the ceiling. Let other kettlebell all the way down to the floor. So you're pressing one kettlebell up while lowering another one all the way down. You can bend the knee to the side to which you bending toward or you can keep both knees straight if your flexibility allowed you. 
Look at the kettlebell that you're pressing up. Make sure your arm is vertical and kettlebell right over your shoulder. As you start coming up, bring kettlebell down to your side and switch. By now you should feel a lot of work on the side of your body. After 10, we'll proceed into simply thrusters. So bring your balls up to your chest, squat and press 10 times. Get up fast, as fast as you can, generating momentum to throw kettlebells up into the ceiling. After 10 thrusters, bent over, slightly bent your knees, we'll do a renegade row. Very simple exercise, just pull one kettlebell up, twist your torso slightly, bring your shoulder back, but make sure to maintain neutral arch at your lower back, so keep your chest up. Next exercise is clean and jerk, also known as a long cycle. Clean, jerk. Repeat 10 times. And we'll finish our workout with 10 swings again. Swing, loosen up, cool down. Thank you for working out with us. If you have any questions or comments, please write them below the video. We would like to hear from you. Thank you again. Uh, subscribe to our channel. Please support us. I will post more workouts like this one or even better. Bye-bye.